Now we're going to get today's sport with Amy and uh, developments on VAR. Yes, a VAR row that's certainly been dominating Scottish football for the last week or so. Thanks very much, Sally. Hello there. The Scottish FA has tonight hit back at Rangers over criticism of an old firm VAR decision and has urged club representatives to show greater responsibility around the issue to what they say avoid compromising the safety of match officials. Rangers had also called for the SFA to publicly release the VAR audio, something the governing body says it's been doing to clubs since the summer. The row has dominated Scottish football discussions since the Old Firm derby and the SFA has urged Rangers to show restraint. It says... Well, while the Premiership might be on ice for a few weeks due to the winter break, the competition continues to heat up in the Championship. Here is how the top four looks heading into this weekend's fixtures. As you can see, just three points separates Wraith Rovers and Dundee United in first and second place, United with a game in hand over the league leaders. For Rovers manager Ian Murray, sitting pretty at the top of the table is a nice position to be in after a seventh place finish last season, and he believes there is still plenty to build on. The Kirkcaldy side, who well done to United manager Jim Goodwin, believes it's great for the championship that there is such an exciting title race, even though he'd rather be at the top of the league. The yes, Sally, the championship is always <laughs> an exciting campaign, never fails uh, to deliver absolutely. on drama. Great stuff. Thanks very much.